According to Brenda, There's too much politics going on at the moment. But aside all this noise in Parliament, there are some key policies and some key ideas being thrown around. So let's take them out onto the streets and see what your reactions are. Parties are obviously gearing up for a general election. We don't know if one will, will definitely happen, but at some point it is very likely. It's got to, it's got to happen. We've got to have a general election now. And more sooner than later. Do you think having that before we have left would help the situation? Would that help to progress things a little bit more? I don't think so. I mean, this Boris Johnson, it don't matter what, whatever he takes to the table, I'm going to throw it out. And what would you say your message is for Boris Johnson and maybe some of the other parties who, some might say, might be frustrating Brexit, others would say they are kind of arguing for, for what a lot of people that support them believe in. What's your message for Bojo? I'll just say, carry on with what you're doing. I think what he's doing is right, and I'll about you for him myself, so what will be, will be. Lib Dems launched their manifesto. Um, they said they wanted to cancel Brexit. Do you think that's quite a, a bold statement to make? It is a bold statement, and really I can't see how they're calling themselves the Liberal Democrats when they're not following the democratic wishes of the people of the country. That's quite an out there thing to do for a party, but I suppose some would argue that they have the support from, from their supporters. Well, it's something that Labour's a bit more hesitant to talk about, isn't it? They're worried about alienating their supporters, so I think the Lib Dems are just trying to win people from both sides by being the most pro-referendum party. And the Lib Dems have got an upward struggle to get a majority when this general election does ultimately come, but they've had quite a few defections to the party. Do you think they could do it? Do you think they could be quite successful with a stance like that? I, I still, in theory, we're still a two-party country, really, and any sort of voting will dilute, uh, for other parties, will dilute, dilute the votes and what, I think. 